Ancient evil bug versus sword wielding savior. Villa Lily is walking through the Zol Plains when she is stopped by villagers from Rattle. What happens when she goes to see well, what is the matter? Huh? Engineers designed a new shirt to convert air guitar into actual music. So wannabe rockers can do music. In, in, in a related story, Creed has announced a new tour. <laughs> you seem to be in a good mood, Thilla Lily. Of course Thilla Lily is. It's a beautiful day. It's nice and warm, and I'm feeling so happy and upbeat. Okay. Glad to hear it. This continent is a wonderful place. A gentle breeze, solid ground, warm fire, and clear water. You came from the Western Continent, didn't you, Thilla Lily? Thilla Lily did indeed. I came here as a missionary to spread the doctrine of my order. Where we live in the Western Continent is so much more chaotic, not like here at all. That's why Thilla Lily is going to do my absolute best on this continent and make sure we find our god. Okay. I want everyone on the Western Continent to be able to enjoy nice and warm days like this. Cool. Phila Lily. If there's anything I can do, just say so. I can help you out. L let's attack aggressively. Really? You're so kind, Al, though. Your big sis, Phila Lily, is so important with many subordinates. Now I shall shower you with words of praise. Huh? No, that that's okay. Don't be shy about it. This kind of chance doesn't come about very often. You see, within my order, Thilla Lily is a first-class real special. Oh, is that who I think it is? Uh-oh. It's some guy. Looks like I'm in luck. I'm so glad I ran into you. Thilla Lily, come to rattle quickly. It, 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 is Steve Peterson attacking again? Will you? Oh, please, right now. Come right now. Do you know that man, Thilla Lily? Looked like he was in a real hurry. Um... Looks like something big's happened, and they're in need of Thilla Lily's help. Quick, Aldo. Let's go to Rattle. I don't know where this song came from, but okay. Alright. To Rattle. Uh-oh. Ah. Ah. We came as soon as we could. Where is this villainous Steve Peterson? Are you okay, Thilla Lily? You've been out of breath since a while back. We can't be ambling along with the village, maybe facing the greatest disaster in its history. Y yeah, the greatest disaster in its history. Huh? Did that guy say that? Everyone, look! You, you came! Thank heavens, we've been waiting! How you doing? Sorry I'm late, but Thilla Lily is here. Thilla Lily is ready for the worst disaster ever in the world. Worst disaster ever in the world? You sure are amplifying this. Maybe there was another mustard truck incident. Please be silent. Shh. Uh, okay. So what's this terrible incident then? Incident? Hmm? 
There hasn't been an incident. Hmm? The reason we called you out here so quick was because the best cook in Rattles invented a new sweet. You said you wanted to always try Granny's new sweets right away. Oh boy. I see. You 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 like sweets, don't you, Thilla Lily? Ah. Some coaches that feared Steve Peterson would would hire it include Walt Harris and Danny Knee. Danny Knee. <laughs> Where's Sean Elbow? Thilla Lily wanted you to see me at this amazing and cool big sis, the commanding officer of, of loads of subordinates, but I guess... My, my, Thilla Lily, I've been waiting for you. Try some of these. I made loads just for you. Oh, okay. Hopefully he he made some for Stan Ankle. You did. Thank you. They're delicious. Oh, I'm so glad. I made some for Moke too. Here you go. Moke. The hell is that? Moke only ever has the same blank expression. I can't tell what it wants. Hey, Thilla Lily, I've been wondering. What exactly is Moke? Is it a cat? How can you expect me to know something like that? Or how one of the coaches Steve Peterson was looking for was Houston Nutt. <laughs> what? But Moke's your Moke isn't my pet. Moke just decided to come with me one day. Moke's just Moke. Oh, okay. Just Moke. Blip! Keeps making almost a computer sound. Thilla Lily is the reincarnation of the sword's wielding savior. And so, if Thilla Lily were to have a pet, it'd be only right for it to be one far more amazing. Hey, you shouldn't say things like that. You'll hurt Moke's feelings. It's Moke! Blip! Blip boop! Blip! Is it sad? It's probably sad because... Steve Peterson kicked a rock at it. <laughs> the little Lily and Moke are both so cute. They soothe my soul. Indeed, Dilla Lily is akin to a granddaughter of Rattle. Oh, 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 don't call me a hoe. Looks like you're pretty popular, Thilla Lily. M maybe she she should become the new a a a athletic director for the Huskers. I. I suppose, but then also no. Thilla Lily is the true reincarnation of the sword-wielding savior. The people of Rattle idolize me. Oh, okay. What exactly do you mean by the reincarnation of the sword-wielding savior? It's a legend of the Order of the West. The West Ham Sandwich, maybe. When the sword-wielding savior descends upon the land... He will be met by one with twelve wings. In other words, Thilla Lily is... The reincarnation of a totally, totally incredible god. 
Ahem, that's how it goes. Alright. That sounds like fun. Did you give yourself this title? How could you say such a thing? Look at me, Aldo. Look how incredible Thilla Lily is. Oh, okay. Everyone, come and tell Thilla Lily, the sword wielding savior, all your worries, great and small. Has anything big happened? Are any wicked monsters bothering you? Thilla Lily will give my absolute all to help those in need. Maybe you should do something about the villainy and dominant rule of Steve Peterson. Th Thilla Lily, calm down. If you ask around that forcefully. Hmm, come to think of it. A child from the neighborhood was attacked by a monster a few days ago. Uh oh. Aha! Is that so? Why didn't you tell me sooner? Well then, tell me all about this fiendish monster. I bet Steve Peterson's behind it. I didn't hear much about it, but Thilalily, this monster, it isn't exactly fiendish. Hmm. I accept this task. I want you all to stay calm. I, Thilalily, will destroy this fiendish monster and bring peace back to Rattle. Wow, you're so incredible, Thilalily. They really like saying our name. <laughs> First, I will make some inquiries, but before that... Thilalily needs a helper, so I will be off to fetch my subordinate. Oh my god. Hey, Thilalily, wait up. Wasn't that old man about to say something? Quest accepted! Good times being had in the Mushroom Kingdom. Bum 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 bum. We gotta go down here. Do 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 How come you were so out of breath before, but now you're suddenly so full of energy? I, I hear oftentimes on Steve Peterson's day off, he likes to stand on quest markers so players can't can't advance quests. How come you were so out of breath before, but now you're suddenly so full of energy? I can't get myself worn out before a big event. I guess. Anyway, is that subordinate of yours somewhere nearby? Indeed, he's almost always around these parts. He is? Who is this person? I'm pretty curious to find out. If it's Houston Nutt, I swear, I'll quit this game. Ah. He's over there! Huh? It, it's Prey! What the hell? It was our Lord's blessing, demonstrating his tremendous love for us. Oh, I can't take anymore! Uh oh. Gah, I heard it was hot, but I thought the sauna sermon was just a rumor. I can see my late grandfather's face in the flames. Uh, I'm shaken from the heat. Somehow he looks more handsome than when he was alive. Pray! Hmm? That voice. Oh! Defeated! 
Ah. Aha! This is our chance to escape. Let's go, Gramps, Granny. They run away. I see you're giving villagers the sauna sermon. I'm sure I told you to do this in moderation. So, sorry, Sister Thillily. I've got... I got over-enthusiastic. Apparently they know each other. To get your deadly jump and stone headbutt once more, Sister Thillily. Okay. They cost Thillily unbelievable pain, so I don't want to. Good grief, Prey. You're always doing this. The direct subordinate of the reincarnation of the sword-wielding savior can't even properly moderate one single sermon. It's just sad. I apologize. I feel so ashamed. Public shaming. You mean Prey is your subordinate? Oh, Aldo, I didn't realize you were there with Sister Thillalily. Enough. Now isn't the time for that. Y y you're right, Sister Thillalily. Am I right in thinking you came looking for me today because you require my help? Of course, it's time for some charitable work. Oh, I see. And what is the nature of this charitable work? Hehehe. <laughs> We're going to exterminate a monster. Exterminate a monster? Houston nut style. Uh, are we really going to do that? That's why I said it. We must defeat the fiendish monster resurrected from ancient times, who's attacking the rattle villagers. I don't think that's how it goes, sir. Thilla Lily, aren't you exaggerating a little? Gosh, this sounds like a difficult job. Pray, what's wrong? Tell me if you have any complaints. I mean, he's not John. N no, I would never dream of such a thing. Then let's head off to find out more from the child attacked by the monster. Fun. Bum bum. Are you the child who that terrible monster attacked? All right! And yet you managed to get back safely. How remarkably brave you are. Stop, you're embarrassing me. Thilla Lily will take care of this monster for you, don't you worry. So we'll need you to tell me all about it. What kind of monster was it? Erm... Um, it was flying real fast. It was flying, that's not good. And it made a terrible noise. I tried to run, but it blocked my path. And once it saw me, it stabbed at me. Uh oh. It stabbed at you. Then when you said it was Phoenix, that may have that may not have been another of your misunderstandings. This monster sounds like trouble. Can you tell me precisely where you were attacked? Uh, okay. It was right in the middle of Zol Plains. Everything's happening at Zol Plains today, apparently. I have all I need. Pray, Aldo, thanks to that conversation, I've been able to identify the monster. The monster is... The Ancient Evil Bug! The hell? I... I... Is that so? Did he actually say that? Aldo? No monster gets away with attacking a child, not on my watch. Not even Steve Peterson gets away with that. Right. I'm off to perform my charitable work before the nuisance girl comes along. Nuisance girl? 
Sister Thilla Lily, you're going too fast. You might fall over. <laughs> Nuisance, girl. I have no idea what's going on. Whatever. Right now, I've got to follow Thilla Lily. Don't we all? Bum, 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 bum. Go search for the monster in the Zola Plains. Yeah. Ba -na -na. We gotta go down there, right in the middle of the map, and such. Black hole. Bum, bum, ba -da 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 Eclipse and... Go for the last one and such. -na 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 -na. There's a dinosaur in the background. That's always exciting. Hmm. I... Thilla Lily did it. I was the first to get here. As I thought, Thilla Lily is the only member of our order to get information on the ancient evil bug. Just me. Now, now I've won against that other girl. What other girl? Thilla Lily? Who on earth is this girl you keep talking about? Alright. Thilla Lily is ready for any monster. Bring it on. This sword of mine will finish you off. Hmm, what's that sound? Did you hear the buzz of the evil bug just now? It could be coming from anywhere. Um, it was more like the sound of wings than a buzzing. Buzz McAllister style. Wings? I see. It must be the flapping of its giant wings as it moves. This evil bug is most certainly bigger than a mountain and heavier than rock. It's a hornet. <laughs> Possibly a Charlotte hornet. No. Okay. What? What? That. That isn't an evil bug? No, no, apparently not. How strange. I was sure it would be the evil bug we found. I have no business with this dull monster. But, Sister Thilla Lily, the monster is flying through the sky with incredible speed. <laughs> and see how sharp its stinger is? That could pierce right through its prey. Meh, you said pray. Hey, eh? Ah! But pray? Pray, are you okay? Pull yourself together! I feel like I have pins and needles. Nothing in particular out of the ordinary. Oh no, I'm so embarrassed. It's like the prick of a sewing needle, nothing more. Bum, 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 bum. Ugh, what are you playing at? Don't worry me like that. I'll strike you with the back of my sword for this. Bad prey! <laughs> Eep! Please calm down, Sister Thilla Lily. It makes a horrible buzzing sound. It can fly quickly, and it stings. This has got to be the monster that Kid was talking about, right? Prey is the perfect punching bag. Ugh. Thilla Lily knew from the very beginning that there was a slight chance this would happen. But we can't be reckless. I don't know why I said reckless. Careless. It may be small, and it may not be the ancient evil bug. But it surely is an awfully strong monster. I'll prove that point now, Aldo. I want you as my support. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, okay. I'm going in. Have fun with that. Meh, <laughs> yeah. 
you defeated it in one blow. N now... Now there's no reason at all for that girl to come. Okay. Th Thilla Lily? What's this all of a sudden? I came here eager to exterminate a monster, and all I got was this tiny feeble creature. That means the evil bug wasn't after the people of Rattle. What a relief. But... C calm down. Aldo, when she's like this, no amount of consoling will ever take effect. Thilily served no purpose here today. I'll be the laughingstock of the people of Rattle now. No, it's okay, Thilily. The people of Rattle won't laugh at you over this. Bleep, bleep, bleep. Moke style. Hmm. Moke suddenly... Huh? Is it... Bleep, bleep. Alrighty then. Well, what on earth's the matter with it? For its face to change color and then run off like that. It may not look it, but Moke is a wild creature, which means it has an amazing ability to sniff out enemies. Cool. The, then, wherever Moke ran off to, there could be another monster. There could even be Steve Peterson. Precisely. This time, I'm sure we'll be greeted by a ferocious monster. Okay. Moke, where's the monster? The monster mosh. Bleep, 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 bloop. Okay. It's eating fruit fallen from the tree. <laughs> bleep, bleep. I think it fell asleep. Mo... Mo... Moke, you're a waste of space. <laughs> Sister Thilla Lily, Aldo. What is it now? <laughs> Stay back for the time being. Oh no, we've got to go back and help quick. Uh, for an adult, he sure does make a lot of trouble. Never in a million years will I make such a self-sacrifice. Meh. <laughs> Pray, are you okay? Uh, I am, somehow. Luckily we managed to chase them away before they stung you, and... You're wrong. Huh? What did you say, Thilla Lily? We didn't chase them away. They flew off of their own accord. What do you mean? Sure, they weren't particularly near Prey when we arrived, but... The monster that first attacked Prey, and the two monsters that came next, must be the same species. Their actions... Aha! What if... Phil Lily, have you worked something out? You two, chase after the monsters right this second. If I'm right, the goal of those monsters was... Well, this time, there'll be an awfully immensely terrible monster, I'm sure of it. Huh? Wait a moment. Sister Thilla Lily, less haste, more speed. Alright. Thilla Lily, pray, couldn't you finish explaining things before you start running off? Apparently not. That is not the way. Well, the mantra fled further into the solar plains. Further as in just a few steps over here. I was sure the monsters flew in this direction, but there's nothing here. Hmm. We've lost sight of them. This is a hard blow. 
Where there's a will, there's a way. We may have lost sight of them, but they can't have gone far. Hey, Thilla Lily, you said you knew what their goal was. What did you mean by that? And when you said there'd be a terrible monster this time... Heh, <laughs> that was sweet of you to listen so intently. Since you still seem ignorant on this, I'll explain it to you nice and simply. Um, thanks? Ahem, are you ready, Aldo? Those monsters from before have a tendency to live in groups. What we saw was basically an army. Maybe it was the Bischoff military. Then how is this terrible monster you mentioned connected to all this? What? I've told you this much already, but you still don't get it. Aldo, you're, you're, you're as slow as prey. Ouch. Err. S sorry, Aldo. I seem to always make Sister Thilla Lily angry. But Prey is always willing to learn, so that's one of his most admirable qualities. S Sister Thilla Lily. And so, returning to the topic at hand, my point is, what attacked both ourselves and the child from Rattle was quite possibly a group patrol. The two monsters that surrounded Prey flew over, sensing something unusual. They were scouts. Having detected an enemy, the scouts would be sure to return to base. And report to the king of their pack. Who's gotta be S Steve Peterson. Gotta be. I see. So you're saying the group of monsters and their king should be here. Precisely. You're a good boy, too, Aldo. Uh-huh. Er, thanks. Still, you seem to know a surprising amount about monsters, Thilla Lily. A surprising amount? That was uncalled for. It's only natural for Thilla Lily, the reincarnation of the sword-wielding savior. Don't treat me like a child. What's that sound? More hornets! There's a big one! It's... Look, Aldo, it's exactly as I said. It is. It is! A group of monsters this size, it won't be long until they start causing real trouble. We've got to do something. I never imagined such a huge monster as this would be hiding here. <laughs> Finally, a monster worthy of the reincarnation of the sword-wielding savior. Aldo, pray, follow me. I will stamp out this monster nesting in the plains. Herdhead. Follow me and everything is alright. I'll be the one to tuck you in at night. Ooh. Bum, bum, bum. Void strike. Terminate. Bum, ba, da, da, ba. Defeated. The battle theme started over for some unknown reason. Enough's enough. Time to behave. <laughs> Darn, it's still not giving up. Ah, it's a stubborn one. This monster, it's pretty tough. You may not have enough attack power, Sister Thilla Lily. I strongly recommend considering a strategic retreat. If not, your magic power may run out before long. Ugh. Ah, I can't. If we just leave these monsters, it's only a matter of time before their king attacks Rattle. And I cannot ever let that... Ah, uh. Thilla Lily, your sword. What happened? She's run out of magic. I knew it. Now we'll be forced to withdraw. 
Oh no. The lily, get behind me. There's no need, Aldo. Pray, you too. My magic power may be exhausted, but I can fight perfectly well with just my physical strength. Ammunition exhausted. Even if I must sacrifice myself to defeat him. Wait, Thilla Lily, don't be rash. Thilla Lily, defeated. Eh? You know, because he's, he's Canadian, obviously. Phew. That has to be in my top five strongest opponents ever. <laughs> I guess I got a little bit impatient. Huh. <sighs> Couldn't you have just done that at the beginning? <laughs> huh? Aldo? What are you saying all of a sudden? What am I saying? What were you doing, Thilla Lily? Prey and I were fighting for our lives, and you and you defeated it with one blow. Well, I'm strong, so it's only natural. Why are you so surprised? It's just, you always use magic when you sword fight. That's correct. But if your standard way of fighting is actually stronger, surely there's no need to use magic. Aren't you just wasting that power? Aldo. He speaks the truth. Well, you see... That girl... I can't lose to the winged child. Winged child? The winged child? Hmm. She has a huge amount of magic power, and so in the West, she's known as the reincarnation of the Wing Child. She's a missionary from my order. That girl is my destined rival. If the Wing Child uses magic to wield her hammer, then I must use magic to wield my sword. But if you use up all your magic halfway through like you just did, then what's the point? I think you'd be better off fighting normally. Aldo, he speaks the truth. <laughs> ah, Aldo, then I will lose to the Winged Child. That can't happen, not ever. I won't allow it. But, but before... When you held your sword with your own hand, you defeated that monster in a flash. Surely it's the same result. Nothing changes. You're still as strong as before. You're wrong. You're completely wrong. Wrong, 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 wrong. Wrong, 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 wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. It would prove that I can't do something that the Winged Child can. I have to do it, no matter what. Okay, I don't think we're going to get anywhere with this. Probably not. Besides, this is the way I fight. Sister Thilla Lily, Aldo. Since you've defeated the monster, perhaps we should return to Rattle and report as such. Probably. Of course, you're right. We need to tell everyone in Rattle about this. They're bound to say how brilliant I am. I don't know about all that. Hey, Prey, I'm counting on you for our usual thing. Usual thing? Ack, that! Alas, it is unavoidable. That's too bad. Put Prey? <laughs> I feel like I'm on cloud nine. Let's set off for rattle. Okay then. Alrighty then. That was interesting. Ah! Damn thing. 
Thank you. Alright. Back to rattle. Ba 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 da da. Hostile forces detected. Dancing flower. External last one. Punch in the face. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Sorry, dinosaur. I don't have time to be messing around with you. I've killed you enough anyway. You know what I'm talking about? Hey, watch it, sir. Dancing tree! Black hole! Ba -na -na. How you doing? Dilla Lily, the reincarnation of the sword wielding savior, will not tolerate any bad monsters. As opposed to good monsters. The root of all evil nesting in Zoe Plains, you wicked monster. Yah! Say your prayers! S Sister Thilla Lily, please give me a clear signal. And try not to make any mistakes. Meh. <laughs> Hush, pray. I know what I'm doing. Besides, it's no fun if everyone hears what I'm about to do, is it, pray? You've. You've got to play the monster properly. When the timing's right, I'll whack you away with my own strength. Uh, understood. Okay then, here I come. Hiya! The hell? Ah! Ah, so that's what our usual thing was. Poor prey. Sh she sure knocked him back a fair distance. Bloop, bloop. And Thil Lily's showing off more than when she actually defeated the monster. And that's how Thil Lily, the reincarnation of the sword wielding savior, sunk the huge villain to the ground. <laughs> Thil Lily, you're exaggerating again. Uh, exaggerating? It was just a little bug-like monster you went to defeat, wasn't it? Well, why would you say that? After I talked to you, I told everyone else, too. About the little monster buzzing around in the sky. Well, what? Ho ho ho, don't call me a ho. Don't you think you're, you over-exaggerated a little? I suppose it's a common enough thing when you're young. You, you're wrong. I'm telling you the truth. Ah. Oh, your sword. Ah, I used two magic in my performance with Prey. Oh. Look, you simply couldn't have defeated such a monster with that level of magic. And there's no way we tell you to go defeat such an immense monster in the first place. Exactly. We'd never tell you about something so dangerous. But but I really did defeat the monster on Zoll Plains. A mighty dangerous one it was, too. I'm not lying to you, right, Aldo? Huh? Oh, right. It's no lie. Though it is a little exaggerated. Meh. <laughs> I was there too. I saw her defeat the monster with my own eyes. Oh, I see. Then. It was you who defeated the huge monster. That makes more sense. Huh? No, that, that's not what happened. You're so amazing. You finished it off with that huge sword. <laughs> and I just hiccup, by the way. Stop this. It was I who defeated the monster. Now the Monster King's been defeated. Zol Plains must be safe for now. My, my. Your help is much appreciated. Okay. 
I got praise hiding behind the, the wall there. Why doesn't anyone believe me? Sister Thilla Lily, how did our performance fare? It surely conveyed your efforts to the villagers. Well, what is this unpleasant aura? Perchance, were your efforts not believed by your audience? It's so... Be quiet! Don't be so impertinent, pray. Oh! Ack! Why, you're all so stupid. Every one of you. How could you not believe me? This was all a complete waste of time. <laughs> Quest complete! Good times. Well, that was certainly something. Um. <laughs> He's got his head in the ground now, unfortunately.